abided Jesus, and ye shall receive power. This is your daily devotional reading. Inspired by the Spirit, August 3rd. Writers impressed by different aspects. For the prophecy came not in old time by the will of men, but holy men of God spake as they were moved by the Holy Ghost. 2 Peter 1 verse 21 As presented through different individuals in the Bible, the truth is brought out in its varied aspects. One writer is more strongly impressed with one phase of the subject he grasps those points that harmonize with his experience or with his power of perception and appreciation, another seizes upon a different phase and each, under the guidance of the Holy Spirit, presents what is most forcibly impressed upon his own mind, a different aspect of the truth in each, but a perfect harmony through all. And the truth, thus revealed, unite to form a perfect whole, adapted to meet the wants of men in all the circumstances and experiences of life. God has been pleased to communicate His truth to the world by human agencies, and He Himself, by His Holy Spirit, qualified men and enabled them to do this work. He guided the mind in the selection of what to speak and what to write. The treasure was entrusted to earthen vessels, yet it is nonetheless from heaven. The testimony is conveyed through the imperfect expression of human language, yet it is the testimony of God, and the obedient, believing child of God behold in it the glory of a divine power full of grace and truth. In His word, God has committed to men the knowledge necessary for salvation. The Holy Scriptures are to be accepted as an authoritative and fireable revelation of His will. They are the standard of character, the revealer of doctrines, and the test of experience. Every scripture inspired of God is also profitable for teaching, for reproof, for correction, for instruction, which is in righteousness, that the men of God may be complete, furnished completely unto every good work. 2 Timothy 3 verses 16 and 17 Inspired by the Spirit, August 3rd